this is from the chapter linear equation in two variable exercise 4.3 question number four let me read out the question the taxi fare in a city is as follows for the first kilometer the fare is rupees eight and for the subsequent distance it is rupees five per kilometer taking the distance covered as x kilometer and to tell fare as y as rupees y then write a linear equation for this information so for this given information you have to write a linear equation and draw its graph you'll write a linear equation for the given information and you'll draw a graph of that equation so it is a simple one so come to the solution so here it is written fare for the first kilometer is rupees 8 it is given in the equation fare for the first kilometer is rupees 8 okay and here it is also uh, mentioned taking the distance cover as x kilometer to tell distance cover as x kilometer is the total distance cover if x kilometer is the total distance cover if you pay for one kilometer then for the remaining kilometer so how much remaining kilometer you have to know after one kilometer it is remain how many kilometer to tell <coughs> distance is x kilometer and if you exclude one kilometer after paying for one kilometer as rupees eight then how much kilometer is remain so from the total distance x kilometer if you subtract one that will give you the remaining distance remaining kilometer to be covered so here it is written remaining distance or remaining kilometer to be covered is x minus one kilometer because x is the total distance covered if you exclude for one if you exclude one kilometer then this much kilometer will remain therefore fare for the remaining distance will be how much here it is given uh, the subsequent distance it is rupees 5 fare for the subsequent distance is rupees 5 so after paying for one kilometer for the remaining for the subsequent kilometer you have to pay rupees 5 for per kilometer so after paying for one kilometer how much kilometer distance you cover for that you have to pay rupees 5 per kilometer rupees 5 for one kilometer so per kilometer it is rupees 5 then for the remaining kilometer it will be how much kilometer remain that much time of rupees 5 you have to pay that is x minus 1 times of rupees 5 5 into x minus 1 suppose if you remain for uh, after suppose you are going for 10 kilometer and for 1 kilometer if you paid rupees 8 then for 9 kilometer to be paid and for this 9 kilometer you have to pay rupees 5 5 5 for each kilometer then how much you have to pay for 9 kilometer you have to pay rupees 5 that means 9 times of rupees 5 you have to pay so similarly it is remaining how much remain x minus 1 kilometer is remain so this many times of rupees 5 have to pay so fare for the remaining distance is rupees 5 into x minus 1 now therefore uh, the equation for this information is therefore the required equation for the information information is all be as you know to tell fair is rupees y 
it is given here to tell fare is rupees y and to tell fare we can be written like this also for the first kilometer it is rupees 8 and for the remaining kilometer it is rupees 5 into x minus 1 this is for the remaining kilometer this is for the first kilometer this together is the total fare remaining fare and for the first kilometers fare this is the total fare and also given in the question total fare is rupees y so this two is equal this is also total fare it gives it also gives total fare so y equal to 8 plus 5 into x minus 1 so this is the required equation but let us make it simple y is equal to 8 plus 5 into x it will be 5x and 5 into 1 it will be 5 but positive negative it will be negative and let us make it more simple y is equal to 5 minus 8 it will be 3 and plus 5x so this is a linear equation for the given information okay one part is done let us recheck the question again what is asking to find write a linear equation for this information yes done it and also draw its graph and also draw its graph we have to draw graph of this equation the first part is done write a linear equation for the information we have written a linear equation for the information now draw its graph now we have to draw its graph so come for the next part to draw the graph graph for this equation graph of what y is equal to 3 plus 5x to draw the graph of y is equal to 3 plus 5x at least we have to take two solution two solutions are taken as shown below so we'll take at least two solution in a table wise So to get the two solution, let me do a rough walk. <coughs> what is the equation? Y is equal to 3 plus 5x. So if the x value is 0, then what happened? The equation is, look at the equation. Y is equal to 3 plus 5x. 5x. X is taking as 0. So what we'll get? It implies y is equal to 3 five zero is zero so zero plus three it will be three y is equal to three so when the x value is zero y value is some so when you take x value as a zero y we got after calculation we get a y value three so when the x value is zero y value is three so similarly if you take x equal to minus one then the equation is y is equal to three plus five x x is replaced by minus 1 then after calculate what you will get y is equal to minus 2 so how you got minus 2 5 1 is a 5 it will be minus 5 and plus 3 minus 5 plus 3 it will be minus 2 so I fill up here when the x coordinate is uh, minus 1 y coordinate will be minus 2 so this is the two points 0 3 and another point is minus 1, 2. These two points will plot on a graph paper and will give a short explanation. So, uh, this is the two points will plot on a graph paper. Since in the question it is asking you to draw a graph, so we need to plot on a graph paper. I should use pencil, but there is uh, no pencil. Then we use the pen. So to draw the graph, 
we need to first of all we need to draw the y axis and x axis this is x axis x dash y y dash this is called origin and let me take at a constant distance it's enough one two three four on the y axis also it is one two three four on a negative side minus one minus two minus three etc and here also minus one minus two minus three minus four and so on so uh, what are the two points the first point is 0 3 x coordinate is 0 not 1 not minus 1 and y coordinate is 3 so the combination will be here this is the first point and second point is minus 1 and minus 2 x coordinate is minus 1 and y coordinate is minus 2 sorry y coordinate is minus 2 here is the second coordination so this is the second point what is the coordinates minus 1 and minus 2 and this coordinate is x coordinate is 0 y coordinate is 3 and let me join it we join them and expand them this is the this line is the graph of which equation graph of y is equal to 3 plus 5 x so this is the graph so this is the graph now you should give a graph number this is the graph paper here let me write graph paper four now we should give a short explanation of this graph short explanation of this graph so here is no space let me change the place the short explanation of this graph is you can uh, you should write a short explanation of this graph okay so the points what points 0 3 that means from that table and minus 1 minus 2 are plotted on the graph paper on a graph paper 4 and these two points are joined and join them them to get the graph of graph of what graph of this equation y is equal to 3 plus 5x graph of y is equal to 3 plus 5x graph of y is equal to 3 plus 5x hence the graph part also done so this is the solution of question number 4